Everybody, it's Chad here with Secret Text Deals uh, with the six $100 gift card winners, and I am super, super, just a uh, super good mood. I don't think that's right at all, but I'm in a super good mood. There we go. Uh, because look at the sunshine around me. It is warm. I get cold so easy, and I just get so... Oh man, I get droopy and sad and just not um, get blah when it is cold outside and it is nice and wonderful and I'm happy today. Ah, oh, it's gonna be crappy next week, but I'm gonna be happy and grateful that it is so warm right now. So um, um, I got the six one hundred dollar gift card winners. Um, Wrangle and Goose and Marley is gonna be a little more difficult because they all too like uh, the warm and so Goose and Goose. Wanna care, buddy? Come here. Come on. Come on. Got their one of their favorites here, carrots. Yeah. So if you stay tuned after the the window, the video, I have some. Uh, I think just some generic video of them playing together the other day. So I thought I'd shoot it because sometimes wrangling is kind of difficult. But there they are. There they are. So anyway, uh, yes. So I'm gonna get to it here in a second. In fact, you know what? Let's go ahead and do um, the very first, the very first winner, the $100 gift card Visa winner. Here we go. Winner number one, first name, last initial, and the last four of the cell phone on file. She found the stores of carrots. <laughs> winner number one is Peter K. Phone number ending in. Get this. Five six seven eight. What are the odds there? Peter K. Five six seven eight. Hello. You just love me, right? You don't you don't want anything from me. You just love me, right? Um, okay, so before I get started, this has really nothing to do with us, but I just finished lunch. My sister told me about this bread and I couldn't I couldn't I don't know, I couldn't not tell you guys about it, you know. I don't know if you ever had this before. This is this is not paid in any way. They're more than happy to send me some bread or whatever, but it's called a Lewis um, keto bread, I guess. I don't do keto, but I do a lot, watch carbs and generic stuff like bread and stuff. That way I can eat carbs and cookies and chocolate chip, banana bread and uh, frozen yogurt where it belongs. But if you never had this, this is the Hawaiian um, Hawaiian bread version. That's like, uh, I don't know what it says. If you don't care about this, I'm sorry, but zero net carbs per slice, 35 calories. Um, gram of fat, lots of fiber and protein. Anyways, it's ridiculous. It actually is like bread. It's fluffy and wonderful and amazing. Try it. There's a couple different kinds. I just got some, some cinnamon stuff in there too. And then cheap though. It was like five or six dollars for a mini loaf of bread. But you know, I don't eat a whole lot of bread anyways. So it's worth it to have something that tastes like that one day. So anyways, again, that's not a paid endorsement. Trump, tell me if you tried it or like it or whatever, but I just highly recommend it. I love it. Okay, getting on to winner number two. Lenore S. Lenore S. Ending in 4355. Winner number three is Shara G. Shara G. Ending in 8893. Winner number four is Jeff F. Jeff F. Jeff F. Ending in 7208. And then I'm going to get the last two winners in a second. Uh, you guys looked at um, the video last week and you thought, oh, that looks warm. It did look warm. Um, but it wasn't warm. I was cold out there. I was I was running in a park, um, and it was it was cold. It just looked like I was warm, but I wasn't. Um, but I tell you where it was a little a little slightly warm. I made a long drive over. Um, it is really I've never been there. It was a few hours away. Um, Death Valley. I'd never been over to Death Valley before, so I figured um, a buddy of mine, um, Aaron, told me about Death Valley and how much how neat it is. And I thought I was like, I thought it was just desolate. It's actually quite neat. If you've ever gone to Death Valley, check it out. And I'll have a few pictures of some views from my runs. I ran some of the flats. It was a uh, unique. My calves were killing me afterwards, but um, that's it. And then lastly, before I get to the last two and, and shut up and let you get on with your Saturday is just another thank you and still shameless begging to continue to help support the adult incontinence products that we've been helping with our local area with. And I'm having even more photos at the end of this of us going sending another truckload of goods. And I'm talking like a semi load worth of goods out. Um, we have overloaded our local area for the time being. And so these are actually going to um, Ukraine right now, Ukraine and uh, Israel. So um, it's when I talk to the gentleman on the phone that's that's facilitating the transport there, it is something that just like we have said, it's not really talked about or it's not a thing that anybody like pushes to endorse to actually um, to provide. And it's a big, 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 big deal that can lead to actual like serious, serious septic illness and death because people do not, you know, change um, 
uh, pretty much adult diapers and pee pads, stuff that leads to infections. It's a big deal, y'all. So please look at the um, the comment and the um, and the description of this video for a link and how you can donate. It's tw it's twenty adult diapers for five bucks. We cover the rest of the cost. It's just just please help us. I know it's a weird cause to get behind, but sometimes the strangest, less talked about ones are the biggest needs that because people don't want to talk about it. So please continue to help that. And lastly, just because you see us shipping out so many to different um, areas. Don't think, well, everybody else is doing it. We don't really need to. The only reason we're able to do that much is because so many of you've done it um, and we want to continue that. So please don't have the mentality of just because everybody else is doing it doesn't mean you don't, you don't need it. We need it. Otherwise, if everybody has that thought, then all of a sudden it comes to a screeching halt. We just want to make sure we show you what your um, generosity is doing. So um, that's it. I'll quit begging. Just please, well, I guess I said I was going to quit, but I'm not. So please, please, please just look at that link in the description and please consider donating some um, adult diapers. Uh, okay, winner number five is Stan M. Stan M ending in seven six two seven, and the last winner of a um, YouTube comment winner is Shirley Bentham. Shirley Bentham, congratulations, Shirley, Stan, Jeff, Shara, Lenore, and Peter. Uh, if you are one of those six people, please, people, please email winner at thatdailydeal.com. Winner at thatdailydeal.com. Marley's being ridiculous cute right now. She's all tuckered out. And uh, Kaya will get your $100 gift card um, emailed over to you to spend anywhere but with us. Uh, I think that's it. And if you just want to stay tuned for some photos of the uh, of the loads going out of all the adult and continent stuff, and then the dogs playing, and then my run on the it's some pretty photos. To me, they're pretty anyway. Anyways, you guys take care. Appreciate you guys as always. Bye.